to my channel. I'm Mr. Rex and I'm, this is Daily Rambles. We're doing another Arrow episode. Woohoo! And today we're going to episode Burned, which is episode 10, I believe. It was actually a really uh, filler episode, just FYI. But it was a good one, I feel like. Um, so the episode is called Burned, and we start off with a fire, uh, fire scene, which a bunch of firefighters trying to out this fire. And, um, this, this firefighter, um, basically dumps turpentine all over this other firefighter and sets him on fire. And then, um, we cut to a workout scene with, um, Oliver, and I'm getting very jealous of that, because I can't do anything on a salmon ladder or anything, because I have no upper body strength whatsoever. But, I'm working on it. But, um, Oliver has a slight mental block. It's been about six weeks since the preview and, um, the time of the, uh, of the timeline of the show. And so he has a mental block. Like, physically he's fine, but mentally he's kind of stuck a little bit. And then, um, Joe, um, this one that died in the fire. That's, um, Laurel's, um, co-worker's brother. He died in the fire. He was the one that got lit on fire and died. And then um, we cut, and so that was a very emotional scene, which was a really good scene, like a really good scene. And then we cut to Mora being depressed, and just moving around the house, because Walter's missing. And she knows he was kidnapped and stuff like that, so um, she's just walking around really depressed and everything. And so then uh, Laurel takes the phone and calls Eric for help. Because um, Joe did some digging and found out that um, he was burning at 500 degrees, but the fire didn't reach above 250 degrees. And so he, um, she's trying to, she was trying to get her dad to help, and he won't do anything about it because, like, hey, he died in the fire. It was a fire accident. So there's that. So she gets kind of mad and takes the phone and calls the Arrow. And he pops up at the apartment, and um, they exchange information. And Lance finds out about it, and he is freaking furious at her. And I mean, a furious. So then uh, we cut to a flashback scene where Oliver almost gets caught, but he doesn't. Then we jump back. To Laurel tries to get dirt on the farm on the fireman, and then we jump to Thea tells Mora to act like an adult, get off your ass, be a parent, and be an adult. He's just like, well, how about I don't talk to your mother like that? And so yeah, then um, Diggle tries to cheer Oliver up, and then um, they decide to do a firefighter benefit, which is actually a really good idea. And Thea tells him, uh, oh wait, sorry, it's a long line. Then the uh, firefighter benefits, so, um, so they start setting up for the benefit, they start asking questions and stuff, so Laura tries to get some more dirt on the firemen, and then the benefit happens. And the firemen, uh, that has been sent fire to everybody shows up and sets, the, sets fire to the club. And then the fireman had basically he had a middle break because he got called the original um, fire from like two years ago because of the uh, structural integrity. Damn. Fly. I don't want to raid that ass. Okay. Anyway, um, well, also I'll be editing the shit out of this one. Um, so, okay. so Laurel tries to get information about the fireman because um, Oliver knows that the, he has a um, 
like a Firefly tattoo, so it's like a nod to the um, Firefly character. Uh, it's kind of simple, but kind of not. So he tries to get information on it, but he's also getting numbers for the benefit that they're deciding to do for the Firefly. So, and then Laurel starts asking questions about the fire. Then he finds out when the people in there that died in the fire is probably the same guy. And he's killing off his crew because the fire chief in charge of it sent basically for the people to come back because the fire was insane and the, uh, the structure was not great on the building. But he decided to say because he thought like, we could have saved it and all that type of stuff. So, um, so at the fire fire benefit, the fireman um, sets fire to the club. And tries to kill everybody because he's been in a coma. Then he wakes up and then he saw his face was half burned. Or it doesn't look burned. It looks like it's half melted. But it's burned. And then he had a meal break. And he tries to set fire to the chief. But Oliver blocks him. And then um, Oliver tries to um, get him to just stand down. And to just get help and stuff. Uh, but he sets fire to himself and goes in the fire and dies. And then that happens. So then we jump to the next day where um, Mora is finally stepping up. She's going to the office to take uh, Walter's place. So the company is doing good. She's trying to be an adult. And then um, Joe is leaving to go visit her mother because her mother needs her. And... Uh, Gives the badge that um, Joe's brother had to give, gave it to Laurel so she can get to the arrow. And then Lance pops up and puts a bug on Laurel's burner phone for arrow. And then the final scene is Oliver getting over his mental block. Basically, that's how this, basically, what the episode is, is how. Oliver gets over his mental block in the entire episode. And but I really like this storyline the you know this filler. It's a good filler episode. So uh, another A plus another A. It's really good. And I think that's about it. So they use a lot of pyro in this. I mean a lot of pyro. But it was a good episode and I really did like it a lot. Um it's how everyone start how Diggle was trying to trust him, trying to build him up, trying to get him back to where he was and stuff like that. So that's really good. And that's going to do it for me. So um, like, comment, subscribe. Comment down below if you want to hear more of this or you want me to do something else because I like other TV shows and I probably will be doing this as well. So that's going to do it for me. So like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.